Sammy's doing all right. Ever since we got your telegram about coming home, he's been climbing the walls. What if the plane crashes? What if the train's delayed? What if they call him back? And he goes stand in front of the kitchen window and sip his whiskey like he was expecting you to come strolling up the sidewalk. Don't say nothing about me telling you that. I won't. He'll be fine once he sees you. Ever since Mama Hell, you know how he gets. up to Empire Bay a year or so after you shipped out. Started selling weed. They call and ask me if I want some. I say, sure. It's free money as far as I'm concerned. And how a month back, Marty drops me a line and says they're moving into heroin, that they're looking for a partner down around these parts. Can't imagine Sammy was too keen on that. I never told him about the weed. That ain't nothing to nobody. But this, I got to talk to him about. I ain't said more than three words, and he's yelling about the feds. How we don't need J. Edgar up our asses, and what the fuck am I thinking? Selling dope with kids running around the neighborhood. We ain't selling no dope to no children. <laughs> like they got any money to begin with. Fucking around the side. That was pretty serious shit. Knew a couple guys over in Nam who were running it. Wound up pissing off the wrong person. Got their throats cut. Shit, man, I know what's what. That's why I'm talking to Georgie about it. There's no way Sal's gonna go along with that. Georgia says he can keep his old man from potting out. We'll steal clear of the high-low with Frisco, just selling the French wall. Georgia's Uncle Lou won't say shit as long as we give him a taste of the action. I don't know, man. Georgia's a cool cat and all, but heroin ain't the kiddie pool. Come in on it with us. I bet he'd agree to a three-way split. <sighs> I don't know. I kind of need to lay low a bit. Come on, we're going through the front. I ain't having your wall here or I ask you the back door. Look who I found panhandling out in front of the train station. Pleasure, man. We barely have two nickels to rub together. Now we're paying for all that. Well, then most likely. Three month apprenticeship to start, then the union lets you in. You tell Sammy and Ellis? Not yet. I'm gonna wait a few days. Didn't want to spring it on them since I just got back. Well, they won't like the head, but they'll come around. You need to do what's best for you. Go ahead and start serving those folks. I'll be back. Give Sammy my best, Lincoln. Yes, sir. Where have you been? Warm meal, warm heart. Oh, sure. Then. You delivering a real blessing here, Lincoln. Thank you. Blessings mine, ma'am. A couple of days back and they already got you working? Ah, I'm happy to do it. Means a hell of a lot to all of us. Don't get old, son. It's a fucking shit show. <laughs> I'll see what I can do about that. 
Hey there, Lincoln. How are you, Regine? I'm good. Nice to see you around the holler again. Nice to see those big brown eyes again. Well, they'll be over at my aunt's place with the rest of me. You should stop by. Maybe I'll do that. Lincoln, we got trouble. Run, Regine. Once we're done with you, Lincoln, like Sammy's next. Just had what? to stop. Don't take a body! Shoot him! You boys ought to be ashamed! Uh, uh. 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 Got him! You sure this is how you want to play this? Last thing they're gonna expect is an attack from the water. You head back round to the row. Stay with the car. I'll meet you over there when this is done. Hope you know what you're doing. Trust me, Ellis. Here in a bit, this will all be behind us. gonna hit the bar, the other's going out. The Perlis. Boss says if we have to burn down half the hollow to get to Sammy, we're doing it. Ain't stopping till that old man's dead. Him, Ellis, and the other one. We ain't your people, cocksucker! We ain't stopping till we find you, bruh! Watch out! Shit! Got nowhere to go! Watch out! Target practice is uh, now. Uh, uh.
I just saw something. Sammy's boy's in there. Kill him. <laughs> 